Hi, my name is Erin Wasson. We're here at Milk Studios shooting my new Zadig and Vildare capsule collection for Netta Porte. I think for me, Zadig and, and Vildare, I mean, anybody that knows the company knows that, you know, aesthetically, it's got certainly uh, a sense of rock and roll mentality, a little bit of a renegade situation going on. So it's like you're getting the quality with like this contradictory mentality, which I think um, speaks to me as well, because I'm all about a good contradiction. It was really important for them to touch base with somebody that was American, as they are uh, trying to, you know, grow their American market, being very well known in France and in Europe. For them to come um, across the ocean and have more presence in the United States, I think that I'm kind of a pretty good candidate for that. With this collection, I just want people to feel easy and, and I want it to be uncomplicated for them. My inspiration for this collection was classic cars and the girls that are like driving shotgun in them. Or driving them, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Probably my two favorite pieces from the collection. I mean, it's hard, there's like, like three favorite. I love the bell bottom jeans. I love a throwback to bell bottoms. I don't see why they would ever go out of style. I love the, uh, the white western button-down blouse with black piping because it's a chic take on a western shirt which i think is something interesting and then the suede jacket with all the ridiculous amounts of studage going on the jacket that i did design for zadig and Boldere is along that same lines where it's got a 70s feel i like a jacket that's a bit longer because anything that's going to drop below your waist is obviously going to keep you warmer and then all that alpaca fur is just you know it's like a throwback to anita and like you know just seems very rock and roll to me my personal style is like just really uncontrived. Some people would probably like to say it's a little sloppy and I think that my sloppy Joe mentality on fashion is intentional. The one thing that people don't know about me is that even though um, I do a lot of talking, that I still like to be a woman of mystery. So there you have it.